Okay, so, this is take two. Let's <laughs> see how many takes it takes to get it all in. So, a lot of people say you haven't got room to practice, and I can appreciate that because uh, I haven't got much room here to practice. But nevertheless, somebody called uh, Wang Hai Jun, who's a Tai Chi master who lives over in uh, Manchester, uh, said once that you should be able to practice the Chen long form, which normally takes quite a bit of space up in the space of a cow lying down. So, let's see if we can do it in the uh, space of my cow lying down here, roughly on this mat. So, I'll give it a go. I'm going to face the fridge, so if you want to join in, you're very welcome to. So, feet together, deep breath in, sinking down, and step out. Open. And close. A circle. Ward off one. Ward off two. Double drag and push. And step. That's turning. Arms go down and then open. Step into big plums. Pounding water. Lazy tying coats, up to the left, open, and then step, wind up to the left, and then shoulder, elbow, wrist, extend, settling into your right hip. From there, ceiling and closing, ward off, roll back, grab your parrot, and push, and then the old duff from above, Ooh. And then open. Bump with shoulder and back. And then push the right foot, turning single whip. From here, coming under, sit back as your arms come up and over. Lowering down. And then left foot turns. Step into big plums. Pounding mortar. From there, small step. As your foot comes in, open, crane spreads wings. And then from there, we're gonna to turn to the left. So, round, green dragon throws pearl. Double dragon, push. And your mobile phone maneuver, so get your phone out. Find out who's there, pick out the tea bag. Show the foam and bag, show them the corner, and then settle. Grasp your knee, sink, let your hands come down, little turn right, and then draw in and extend. And three diagonal steps, let's see if we've got room for this. So pull back, step one, pushing slightly right. And turn, close up, step two, pushing slightly left. Close up again. Step three, cricket box. And then hidden fist. Draw the fist in, sitting into your right hip. Right foot pushes, elbow comes back, fist extends. From there, over to the right, sweeping under, over to the left. Left foot turns in, and then bump of shoulder, elbow, and wrist. And then from there, Right foot wants to move, so sit back, right foot comes round, arm follows, picking plums, pounding water. End of section one. So, from there, just to keep it a bit easier, I'll turn around again. So, open, step right, holding down. Turn, and then left foot pushes, pull one way. Right foot pushes, pull the other way. Left foot pushes, pull back the elbow. And then dragon emerges, back fist. Sit back and hold. Up and under. Sit back and offer. And then small step and let the arm follow. <coughs> Little ward off. Left foot starts to turn. Stepping in. Hands come in. And then push high. Weight goes over to the left. Rolling ball, right hand under, weight right, push. Weight left, and settle. 
from our repulsing monkey. Not sure I've room for four of these, so we'll see how we've got on. So first off, open. Step back one. Open. Step back two. Open. Step back three. And then from there, we're going to turn to the left. So left foot's in front. And then from there, we're going to roll back. So step back, roll back. Foot comes in, hand on your arm. Step back into white crane, spreading wings. And second. From there, green dragon. Hold him down and push to the corner. Double dragon push again. Lift up and step. Don't we'll move our phone maneuver again. Come in round. Find out who's on your phone. Pick out the tea bag. Show the phone the tea bag. Show it the corner. Or in my case, the kettle. From there, wave to both sides. So a little wave right, little wave left. Bring your foot in. Wave right again. Wave left again. And lift up. And then White Snake spits out tongue or Mrs. Lee offers noodles. Take a step, hook, and as your back foot comes in, jab with fingers. And then sit back, elbow over your shoulder as your left palm strikes forwards. Sit back, arm goes down, knee comes up, use that to turn towards the door, in my case. Hand and foot go down. Step out, and another hidden punch. Weight right, turn your fist over, sitting into your right hip. And then right foot pushes and punch. <coughs> Little ward off. Left foot starts to turn. Hands coming in. And pushing down this time. Rolling the ball. Right hand under, left hand under. And then bump. And back. Single whip. End of the second section. If I make it through this next third section, I'll be breaking my record. So, cloud hands. So, I'll just do a few turns on this one. So, first off, wave to the right. Step in, wave left. Run out of room. So, use your foot turning behind or step behind. Turn. Step left. Step in one. Step left. Step in two. One more time. Step in. And I'm going to turn again. So we'll call that the last of the cloud hands. And then turn to your left. Step in to pick plums. Coming down into your palm. Lift up, white one. Step back. <laughs> That's where it all went wrong last time. And then high pat on the horse. So hands come up. As your elbows come in, swing the left leg behind you. Use that to turn towards the fridge, in my case. A mess. Wood off. Roll back. Separate feet. So, hand and foot come over. Sink down. And then as your arms come over, foot comes up. So one. I reckon I've just got that. I've got room for two. Sink down again. Arms come over, foot comes up. Two. Step behind. Roll back. And then step right. Open. Unwrap the G-strings, so grab your G-strings, and then a little turn of your body <coughs> separates. Pick up this, and then left heel kick. <coughs> so, three diagonal steps in theory, but I think we're going to have to do a bit of a turn. So one, two, and then we'll turn. Double dragon push to the right. And then punch in the ground. So you've got left foot forwards. Coming round, start to make fists. Get a sense of a left fist picking up, the right fist dropping down. And then from there, elbow. So, turn your foot in, right foot comes back, elbow over your shoulder. And then sit back. You might notice it took an extra sticky step back as well there. And then the double jumping kick. So, back fist. Now, if you've got lots of furniture nearby, you might have to do this quite slowly. But round one, two, three, and down. I'm a little bit short for space there. A man step, pull to the left. Break over your knee. Throw. From there, roll to the right. Shift for weight, yoga ball, again, roll to the left. Second yoga ball. And then fist protecting the heart. Sink in, closing up. And then from there, ward off. Roll back. More press, 
Let your hands separate, come round. So, left knee on the right, lift up. And then, it's going to be a slightly modified tornado kick without hitting the fridge. So, arms separate, left foot comes round. Turn, elbow. Hope you all did that okay. Step left, onto right heel kick now. So, unwrap your strings. Bring your right foot in. Unwrap your strings. <coughs> Pick up fist, and then kick to the right. <laughs> Turn, chop. Hand and foot go down, step out. Weight left. Draw in, ready for another hidden punch, and again, punch. A man tiger walking into cave, so rolling over to the right. Step in, and jump. Take a step. Small chop, and then from there, uh, reach in into the four corners now. Not sure how this is going to work. Take a step, one. Turn to your right, so top hand, left hand's pointing towards the corner. Take a step, turn both feet, second corner. Third one's that way. Take a step with the left foot, left arm comes up, reach to the corner. And the last one over your right shoulder. Sit back, turning, foot comes in, take a step. And off to the corner. And then from there, roll back. Grab your parrot. Step in and push. Rolling the ball. And then bump back into single whip again now. Finish up the section. Open. And settle. So now into the short section. So first off, forward trick, backward trick. Wind up and then turn your foot. Step in one. Step out, two. Wave to the right, wave to the left. And then parting horse's mane. I'm going to be short on space on this, so. Lift up, turn one. And then I'm going to turn to the right, take a step with the left foot. So left foot's forwards, lift up. Second horse's mane. Reach over, ward off, roll back. And then turn your foot slightly, step in, and chase. Roll back again, and push. Back into single whip again now, rolling one, two, up, and second. And then from there, rolling shoulder, a really short section. Coming under, foot comes in, turn to the right, holding down. The Tai Chi bunny hop, one, two, three, up. Off of the right, left hand, and then pull the elbow back. <laughs> Foot goes down, turn on the heel. Step one. Step behind, turn on the ball of one foot, the heel of the other. Turn into your right. And then from there, right foot steps, back into lazy time coat. So wind up, turning to the right. And settle. Ward off, roll back. Push. Roll in the ball again. And step. Bump. Back. Open. And settle. Back into the normal size sections again now. So, power hands again. We're going to step behind so I can put some extra turns in. So, step one. Behind. Step two. Behind and turn to your right. Step three. Behind. And then step again. Roll back, ward off, and then sweep him a lotus. Foot comes in, hammer fist, snake creeps down. If you've got enough room, you might need to step slightly, then sink, and then up, one. So have the right hand on the inside, if you're doing a new style form, lift up and down. Jazz hands, maybe a small step, one, and then elbow. Left arm and knee coming up. Foot goes down, open. Repulse the monkey again four times, at least in theory. We'll see how many we've got room for. One, two, three, and we'll turn to the left. And then four, rolling back, rather than doing four repulse monkeys. And then from there, step back, hand onto the arm. White crane spreading wings. 
round, same as the first section now, same as the second section, double drag and push. And the old mobile phone manoeuvre. Round and open. And waving both sides to the right, to the left. Sit back, wave right, wave left, lift up. And then step in, white snake. Sit back, turning. Take a little step left, so you've got a little bit more room to the right. Right arm goes down, knee comes up, use that to turn it. Foot goes down. So feet close, and then take a step. Weight left as you open. Weight right. Sitting into your right hip. Right foot pushes. <coughs> little ward off. Left foot turns. Step in and push. Repulsive monkey. Repulsive monkey. Single whip. End of the section again. So that's end of section six. Last set of cloud hands now. Let's see how much we've got room for this time. So, step one, I think I'm going to have to turn straight away. Step out. Step two. Step three. Step in, so you can remember which way to do it this time. So step in, pick plums, and then change your mind. Shoulder and elbow back. Open, and then high pat on the horse. Sit back, swing the left leg round. Turn and push to the corner. And then elbow comes in. Right arm goes round in a circle, other hand goes up and over. And then hands cross, turn to the right. Almost in front, take a step. Roll back. Left hand comes back over the top. And I sweep him lotus. I'm going to turn to the right. So my foot comes in, sweep across, turn, drop the hands, and the foot goes down. So now we're facing the corner. Take a step. Weight left as you open. Weight right, settling in four, all together, low punch. So I'm going to body up right still, avoid the temptation to lean over. And again, right foot pushes, starting movement off, and then strike. <coughs> and then from there, both hands make fists. Back fist to the right. I'm not sure how much room I've got on the left, I think I might be a bit close. Left foot turns, arm and knees coming up, and then step. Go we'll pull your ears off, turn, come in rounds. Step in, just about in a room to push, rolling the ball again. And then step, bump, back into single whip to close the section. Last section now then, so right arm coming under, both hands make fists, sit back, and then up and under, left hand on the inside this time, and then seven stars coming underneath, and then throw the fist forwards, <coughs> step back to right hand, and then foot comes in, arms come in, so right hand on top, both palms facing, left foot on the ball, as your heel pushes out, the hands turn, and you're separating something apart. Right foot starts to turn. Now we're going to turn towards the right slightly. So arm and leg come round. Take a step. Weight forwards. Sweep in lotus. So foot comes in. Sweep the leg up and round. Hope you all did that without hitting anything. And then roll back. Cannon fist. Hands coming up your body and then throw. Stepping in at the same time. <coughs> and then from there, round, turn, face the fridge, in my case. Little step. Stepping in to pick plums. Down into your palm. Lift up. And close with pounding water. And just to close off, breathe in one. Breathe in two. Breathe in three. And if you've got enough room, feet together. Step in. And get it in out of the fridge. Hey, how's that? Well, I hope you all managed to do it without getting through too much furniture or too many light fittings. Uh, but on the good side, you don't have to reach far to cool yourself down afterwards. 
。死咗先。